<laughs> Welcome back to the Tactical Muffin Top channel, everybody. I bet y'all didn't catch that sneak peek I threw in the last video. Well, this is a tachyon little battle belt. This is a Gen 1. Um, it's got a little rubber in here. And the Velcro's apart. And this cinches up. This is kind of like a knockoff cobra buckle. But it works. I wear this out in the cornfield walking them for squirrel corn. I uh, I do a lot in this belt. You know what? When, I, when I'm when training and I'm cutting a little bit of weight. I might be a tactical muffin top. But uh, I've cut almost... I keep I keep going back and forth between 70 and 60 pounds down this year, guys. I'm really trying to, to get get in shape. All the things going on in the world really got me worried about my health. Uh, having the young boy around, I really want to be everything I can be for him so I can enjoy playing with him and stuff. I got uh, some health issues and my back's tore up. and Well, I want to carry that boy around uh, in the playground for as long as I can, right? So I'm working on it. It's all you can do, right? You work on it. You work on your preps every day. You work on being the better you you can be. You work on being the best dad you can be. Tactical muffin top right there, boys. But a um, little shout out to being a family guy there. Um, now these these tachyon, tachyon, whatever they're called. Check out uh, 704 Tactical, man. He, he really tests a lot of good budget gear. I've had this for, God, I think four years plus. It's got these laser cuts. I got this omnivore on there. It runs good. Just lock tied up everything real good. That's how I run it. I run a dump pouch back here. It it works good. Man, I walk a couple miles on the treadmill with this, with a plate carrier and an AR and a rucksack, a little bug out bag type deal. Hey man, if my fat ass can get out and do it, guys, anybody can do it. You can do it. You can get in shape. You can be tactical. You can be tactical. You can be the best you can be for your family and you do not have to spend a fortune to do it you just have to have the will to do it i fight through the pain guys i got a bad back i got a bad hip now because of my bad back i'm only 30 i got like a 90 year old man back doctor told me holy crap i just had i just gave surgery to this 80 year old dude he said his back was better than yours i'm like well go ahead and donate the parts over because i got a ways to go yet before i'm 90 but uh that didn't work out so what do we do we do what we can do guys this is the tactical muffin top shout out to a 704 tactical he uh, has a great youtube channel he really puts some gear through the test so if it's on a couple of those torture site channels guys run it i think i got this belt on sale with his code or something like that i don't know i got it for like 40 bucks 30 or 40 bucks it's great I'm a big fat guy and I got no ass, so this thing works great. I don't know. I'm ruining my setup here. But uh sneak peek to the next one. It's trying to standardize everything. They got the Gen 2 boys. Tacticon, Tacticon. Whatever. I'm only I'm working on getting their chest rig too. Same omnivore. Blackhawks uh, Black Omnivore. I was so angry. I, like literally the week after I bought this one for 50 bucks, they went on sale for 40. Oh well, I got it now. That's what matters, right? These ETS Max guys, don't run these for like duty or serious use, but run this stuff for your training. If you're out running around in a cornfield or you're out in a draw hunting or whatever, you bust a pocket for deer in the morning, you've messed up. Go ahead and shoot a couple rounds. If you got a bunch of private ground, you can go to the next draw. Go ahead and bust a couple rounds at a coon or a coyote when you're driving around the cornfields. Try them out. Don't bet your life to it. I just got them in here. I put, put ammo in them. I think I shot that one. I think I actually ran the dagger through that one and it ran fine. But you just put them in there for the weight. So you can get the real world weight. You can see what jiggles and whatnot when you're walking. See if you need to strap anything down with some like zip ties or some paracord. See what works for you. This gets you the real the real world weight when you're out walking around. Throw this under the back seat of your truck, guys. This is, dude, on Black Friday is a really good time to pick this stuff up. I'm actually building one out for my brother-in-law right now. I mean, guys, this is a good company. These are good, and this one has uh, this is the Gen One one, right? It's rubberized, single single belt. Other than that uh, that Velcro deal, 
in that belt, right? This has a little inner belt that's Velcroed on. And you put this on and then you can run your, your outside belt on there. And uh, I went with Ranger Green and Woodland Camo on this one's how I'm decking this one out. Um, this one works better in my area for the spring and summer. This one works better for the fall with some white camo. Fall and then go into winter. We get a lot of dirt. We get a lot of sand out in Nebraska. We get yellow, yellow dead big prairie grass. And you run some, some white burlap through some of these loops. Camo it up. Get it dirty. Heck, you, guys, you can be budget. You can cut up a couple old wife beaters and into strips. Camo it out, man. Strap, strap some onto you. A little spray paint. Guys, do not be afraid to spray paint your stuff. It's fine. It's your stuff. If you know this is never going anywhere, this is just another one to the pile. I want to have 10 of these. I want to be like, uh, what does Duke Liberty say? Uh, I want it to be like Terminator 2 when they're in Mexico and they open that armory. He said that's what he wants. Well, Duke baby, you might be able to hit that point, but I, I'm not. I want to have four. That's my goal on everything. I want to have four of everything the, the exact same. For this holster, for the light. Four Glocks. Now, I know you like to carry the 17 Duke. Um, Honda, you like to carry more of the, the 19 size frame. The 19 fits me perfectly in the winter, you know, or in the, in the summer months and stuff. In the winter, I like to carry this one because it, it works better with gloves. It's the 22. It's just a little bit bigger. Finger grooves on the Gen 4s don't bug me, guys. They fit my hand perfect. I got kind of... Some big, large, fat Sasquatch hands. Corey, you can relate. That's why you carry that big old Glock 45, big dog. Shout out to Corey. He's a great guy. You need to start your own channel, man. You crack me up. You, you're a good-hearted guy. I really like your... You got some good opinions. And uh, you should start your own channel too, buddy. I would, I would watch it in a heartbeat. But Yeah, man, this Tacticon, Tacticon, whatever, however you say it. There it is. Check out 704 Tactical. He'll have a discount code for Black Friday, guys. Buy these up. Standardize your units. Standardize your mags, man. This is how I look at it, okay? I want one for me, my wife. I want one for my son. And I want one for a buddy kit. That's kind of how I'm looking at it. I want one for everybody. One day when I'm old and gray and my, my son can't buy these anymore. And they're all grandfathered in and all you can have is what you have. That 40 cal, you could run that 40 barrel, run that 40 ammo. When there's no more 9, right Duke Liberty, baby? My boy can run this stuff if I have it and it gets grandfathered in. My mags. All my mags. Who cares? Who cares? I want my son to have more than I had. I want my son to have a thousand of these. Guess what? If 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 20 of them break, who gives a shit? You got a thousand of them, guys. I want him to have as many dang mags and as much guns as he's going to need. I want my, my rule is four, okay? I want one for, my, for me. I want one for my wife. She likes this 22. She likes this 22. Where's that? This is her this is this is her bedroom gun, especially when I'm out of the house doing stuff. I'm out hunting or something. She loves this with this with this freaking strike industries mag in here. Because when you're holding this, it balances so good. She can't feel the recoil when she shoots this thing, guys. And it's a 40 cal. People say, oh the 40, blah blah blah. I can't tell the difference in recoil between 9 mil and 40, hardly at all. Uh, except for the round count. I like the round count of the nine better, but um negligible right negligible sorry guys i got a cold but um no this is awesome uh my wife loves it i like to train with it i like to put up i like to put one extension and one flush because i got that tactical muffin top boys i got that tactical muffin top guys so when my big fat butt's carrying this bad boy my gun be laying right over here, and it fits perfect. It doesn't bug me getting in and out of the cars. Now, if I had it flipped around, it'd bug the crap out of me because that'd be poking me the whole time. But. Tactical muffin top, stay keeping it tactical. This is for generations beyond me. Our preparations, guys, should be thought of as making that armory in Terminator Two for our next of kin, for their babies, for our great grandbabies. Because when our great-grandbabies are around, they might just see a picture of us or see the land or the house we built, right? But they're going to need this more than we need it. And we might have World War Three around the corner, guys, but they might have World War Four. 
And they might only have what we give them. They might only have everything we give them. So yeah, you can have a, a shadow, uh, a, free, a CZ Shadow 2, like a $2,000 race gun. Guys, none of us are all running race guns. Most of us are working regular jobs. You don't need that. You do not need a, uh, you don't need like, I don't know, like a Raptor 2 Kimber 1911. You don't need that, guys. You don't need that to be tactical, to protect your family, to put food on the table. Look at this. I do this as a side gig to put some extra cash away for rainy day. You don't need all that Gucci crap. Everybody's like, oh man, I have a, I have a $500 battle belt. Jesus, guys, are you a contractor overseas? Or are you a tactical muffin top living in Nebraska? You don't need that, guys. You can be tactical. You can be effective and train. And if you have everything in the same spot, holster in the same spot, mag in the same spot, same orientation, forward for the pistol mags, rear facing... Because it's easier getting in and out of a car. Rear facing, guys, with the AR mag. I run, I'm trying to run two. I'm trying to run a 40 back here and a 30 up here. That's neither here nor there. The uh, cost, cost effect of the 40 is not great, but I like it. Um, uh, you do not need to spend a lot. If you have four of these belts, all the same, and you have four PSA ARs, you can face somebody north, south, east, west. And if you need help at one of those locations, you can have people move to your location. You can defend a house. Point in four ways, guys, at minimum. And if you have somebody else in your mag, your group, your family, most people's, you know, got some family in their mags, right? If everybody's coming to your house when shit hits the fan, and everybody else has done at least this for them and their wife and their, and their kids, and everybody has at least one buddy kit... You can help somebody who couldn't get home to get their gear. You can help somebody in your mag. And if you all train together, you have the same holster. You have a, a Glock mag fed weapon. Whether it's a police trade in. Whether it's a brand new Glock. Whether it's a dagger. Guys, this is this is what you got to do, man. This is, this is where it's at. To save money. To get everybody on the same page. You don't have a guy stocking 10 mil because he likes it. He likes the ballistics. You don't have a guy stocking 45 because 45 ain't ever going to die. I got a 1911 guy. You stock the same light. You stock the same holsters. Everybody can run inside the waistband, outside the waistband. You stock the same mags. Just doing that. You run the same platform. They can run the same mag. Everybody helps everybody. If somebody can't get to their gear. And if you have one, at least one buddy kit with your family covered, you have somebody who can watch your back while you sleep, while you're farming, while you're hunting. You have somebody that can help your family. You can, you can make it. You can survive better. Standardization on a budget with decently effective, decent quality, proven track record. Our sheriff's department still runs this gun, guys. They can't get off it because of budgets. You know what? I buy them up when they have their police sales. I got a deputy buddy, and he hooks me up. I get their ARs for cheap. 500 bucks. 